There are times when slow, careful deliberation over the grade of a coin is not an option. When you're at a coin show and are interested in a coin, you'd like to make an offer that's in your best interest. The seller has probably graded the coin. Is it an accurate grade? Learn how to make a quick grade so you can make a reasonable offer. Or when you have a group of inexpensive coins to sell and you want to price them quickly, use quick grading. Obviously, quick grading is not recommended for expensive coins as making a mistake in that realm can be costly. The highest points on the buffalo nickel, obverse and reverse, are shown here. These are the areas where the coin will show wear first. To assign a quick grade to a buffalo nickel, look at the coin overall, front and back. Then focus on the horn of the buffalo. That is the point where a quick grade can be determined fairly accurately. The images here show what the horn looks like as the coin wears. Most grades should be fairly easy to determine based on the visibility of the horn. There is one region where it is a little more involved, the range between uncirculated and about uncirculated, that is AU50 to MS63. The differences here are small but can make a big difference in the value. Look at the high points under a light and rock the coin back and forth. You will see either uninterrupted mint luster or a break in the luster where there is wear. A break in the luster means the coin is not uncirculated. After you determine your quick grade, re-examine the coin overall and look for problems. If you find problems, you should lower the value.